Hey guys, welcome back to another game making tutorial. And today is our final episode before moving on to creating our first shooter game. In order to be prepared, this is a tutorial on the basics of alarms, as it is a common feature used in our next game. So what are alarms? Alarms are basically a type of array and will run when its relevant variable equals zero. This means if I call, let's say, add event, go to the create event, dragging the code from the control section, and let's say we set alarm zero and set it to 15. All right, actually, let's make it longer. Let's go around uh, 60. This is basically two seconds because our room speed is 30 and our room speed equals one second. So we can just do this room underscore speed times two. So this will say the alarm zero will be triggered in two seconds. Now let's add an alarm zero event. And this block of code will be triggered after two seconds. So in here we're going to, uh, let's just do a game underscore end. But I just wanna show you um, how this works. So we'll play the game right here. One, two, and boom. It just closes by itself. It's actually kind of simple. So alarm zero calls room speed times two, which is two seconds, and I'll call this. Now, every object has 12 alarms, which can be used for different purposes, as you can see right here. Now let's try another example of how to use an alarm. Now alarms can also be a reoccurring. For example, uh, let's make this three seconds. And in alarm zero, let's show, un show underscore message. Okay. And here we just said that um, uh, level up or something. <laughs> All right, cool, level up. And let's call it again. So alarm zero in another three seconds. So let's, let's see what's happening here. In the create event, we're calling the alarm zero in three seconds. After that three seconds is done, it triggers this event and it shows the message level up. And then it calls it again in, a, in, another, in another three seconds. And this happens over and over again. Let's play and see, let's see what happens here. One, two, three, level up. Okay. One, two, three, level up. So this, so this happens over and over again, and this is very useful in games, such as features like a wave system, a, um, a leveling up system. Depends on what, kind, what type of game you're making. But for our shooter game, it's for a wave system where more enemies will come swarming in every wave. Yeah, so that's actually kind of it. That's kind of the basics of Alarm. Um, I really hope you enjoyed this tutorial and the series. I really hope to see you guys in the next uh, video, uh, video series yeah, about a space shooter. And it's going to be really cool explosion. It's going to look really sick. And I'll also provide you with some awesome sprites. So... Thanks for watching guys again, and I'll catch you guys in the next tutorials. Peace.